the Macedonian song. You know, to set a Fabio straight. But this was the thing about Fabio that him and his fellow lawmakers were sharing prayers in their email addresses. So they got money. They didn't want to buy their cars. But the government didn't get money. And it goes back to promises. So that means the July promise sent President Tinubu made that 225 million tons of, thousand tons of uh, grains were going to come out uh, for the people and all of that. All of those things were not achieved. Because it was part of those things he made the promise of the the 30 billion, which was supposed to be part of our cultivation, too, you know, of all of these grains across the country. So it speaks volumes. And that's why when Abadio insulted us by saying, We, the protesting hungry people of Nigeria, were sponsored to protest. I think we got for people. And that's why you heard what, uh, uh, what's it called, uh, intellectual luminary, Professor Patterson, said yesterday. That's the reason why it's not mine. He said, Abadio should shut up. That's what he said. Because if you can't solve the problem, then don't complicate it with your insensitive, dirty talk. Alright? I'm happy for him, I need to have told it. Nobody gave us any 30 billion, so shut it. Uh, okay, the problem, I, I do not know what, what it is with Gospel Pabio. You know, recently he has been faced with a lot of backlash for every statement he has made. Uh, talking about a Mayfele, uh, talking about uh, protesters, and now talking about uh, one trillion naira. That mm. is 30 billion distributed to every governor. Uh, you know, at this point, you get to ask yourself, is he really even helping the administration of Bola Ahmed Sinubo, or is he even putting him more in the abyss? Uh, for Nigerians to actually criticize well, this well, administration. Well, I'd recommend you go and read um, uh, Chef Adeni's article on Gosso Lapati. I mean, you'll hear more of that. So, but people have posted that he's always been like that. So, I mean, that's the administration of not That's their own cup of tea without sugar. All I'm just saying is that people should be more sensitive to the plight of suffering people of Nigeria. That's my priority. I mean, I don't care for politics because I care for Nigeria. Both Nigerians that are suffering. That's what matters. And when people are suffering, at least your world should be soothing, not very intense. Mm -hmm. If you want to learn from me, the counterpart is the House of Rep. I said very soothing words on the turn of the challenge in Nigeria for people. Hmm. So. All right, um, Mr. Fai, we're seeing um, 